What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to be teaching you how to download and install ISO games and mods if you have the mods for for the game you want. Uh, it's really simple, real easy. First thing you're going to want to do is download a torrent program or torrent downloader. Uh, I use uTorrent. I'll link it in the description. Uh, there's other ones you can download, but I recommend uTorrent. After you have that in, installed and download, you're going to want to download Xbox Image Browser. This opens up the, the ISO so you can download the files and replace files if you have mods or whatever. So download that and then you're going to want to download whatever game and mods if you have mods for it. Uh, I'm going to show you all where I go to download my games. I go to the Pirate Bay. Uh, as you see I already got GTA 4 right here. Uh, whatever game you're looking for just make sure it's it looks legit and you people commented that it works and all that um, so after you found the game you want you're just, and you got the program downloaded you're just gonna wanna uh, press get this torrent I already got it added right here but I'll press yes again um, so after it's downloaded or whatever you're just gonna wanna open the file so after you have the file open or downloaded I'm sorry you should have two files like this uh, DVD file and a disk image file this is the one that you're gonna need the ISO uh, the DVD you don't really need to worry about so after you have that you're just gonna wanna open up Xbox image browser go to file open image file then you're gonna go to where the where the ISO is at whatever folder GTA 4 and then you're gonna click on the ISO then you're gonna get this right here if you wanna play the game without mods if you just wanna without mods all you're gonna do is go right here right click and then go to extract and then make a folder or whatever make a new folder or whatever you want and you just save it you click OK and then all the files will download into that folder and then I'm gonna show you what you do after that but if you want to ha put mods on it all you're gonna wanna do is whatever, whatever mods you have I have these mods right here is you're just gonna wanna replace the files so you're gonna go you're gonna look for wherever the files are in this case for GTA 4 it's in CD images and you're gonna wanna um, replace those so script network image you're just gonna go to uh, replace then go wherever the you have the mods downloaded so mine would be in GTA 4 mods and then you're gonna replace script network image so you go to open and it'll replace it replace it right there and then script image you're gonna want to replace that so script image all right it replaced it so now I have mods on my GTA 4 all you're gonna want to do is like I said before extract and then I'm gonna extract it into GTA 4 so we're gonna extract that I'll be right back after it's done extracting. Alright, so once you've got that downloaded to your USB, what you're going to want to do is plug your USB into your Xbox. Alright, so once you've got your USB plugged in, what you're going to want to do is go to my games, XEX menu. Okay, and then you're gonna want to go to your USB, copy the the game, go to your games file, and then you're gonna paste it. I already have the game, so I'm not gonna paste it. But after that, you'll get the file, and then you're just gonna want to start the XEX, and bam, you got the game downloaded with the mods that you want. 
that simple and that easy. If you uh, like this video, make sure to drop it a like and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. I'm Mazaholic. Thanks for watching.